Hey guys, uh, Zach Mods here, and I want to show you something really quick. This video is about how to use like a PS3 remote on a tablet. So basically, what I did one second is if I can find them, I was able to also PS4. This works with PS4. I can probably show you them all. I don't know how much time we'll have, but. Anyway, how this works is, uh, you either need an OTG cable, uh, you can go on, on Amazon, eBay, I actually bought one, but it has not come in yet, I bought it, like, two days ago, and I got it for, like, 75 cents from China, but since it's from China, it's gonna take, like, a month to come in, so, it's gonna take a while to come in, but I got a really good deal on it, and, anyway, so, what I did was, I figured out how to connect them, but I have this thing I got on eBay, 10 bucks. Works on the PS3. It's not a real PS3 remote, but for some reason, it does not work on the tablet. So if you have a PS3 remote that is not a real Sony brand, it most likely will not work. But, I also found, I found one way to make it work wireless. Now, there is other ways, but they're a lot more complicated. With this one, it's super easy, but you do need an older model remote. So this is my uh, custom MW3 remote. It's blinking because it's connected. But look what I got here. It's like this little thumb drive, it kind of looks like, that, that makes the wireless signal happen. So I was like, you know, maybe that will make it work wirelessly. So I tested it, and it's actually working. And I'll show you some gameplay in a second. So... I don't have any many games. I, I'm using an old tablet. It does have a USB port on it, and it's it's the Toshiba Thrive. It's a little old, so it, it, there's some games. It's like on older software, so there's some games that that can't do this. Oops. Whatever. So if that's not the first thing that's happened. It's fine. So uh, let me show you. Let's get into it. One second. I will be back in a second. Alright, I am back, and to prove that this thing is not like Photoshop or something, I want to show you. Here's the drive, or whatever. So here's what we're going to do. I don't know what they call it, but but you know where they fake it or something. So, here's the remote. I'm going to move it this way. It's, working. it's really simple. All I did was I just plugged it in. Actually... I've also done this with keyboards and wireless mouses. They have like the same thumb drive kind of idea. So if you have a wireless mouse, that will connect to an also little mouse thing on the screen. But look at I'm I'm doing I'm not even touching the screen, and you can see this remote is connected right here, and it works great. And it's the same thing with any real Sony brand remote, PS4, PS3. If you uh, plug it in with the cord will work or if you happen to have a really old one like my custom mw3 remote that will also work uh wirelessly because of that little usb thing just like one of those wireless mouses i am sorry the controls are different and i have not gotten used to them but i think that's it for today um i don't know what else i can talk about uh i think you know if you check it out if you try it on your own you'll like it OT, otg otg cables not that pricey especially even from china so try this if you want you know uh i would totally recommend it but also remember these off-brand remotes do not work with this so you have to get a real sony brand remote ps3 or ps4 you know what, while you guys are here, I'm going to show you it with the PS3, or I mean PS4 remote, just cause, uh, one second, this thing is kind of hard to get out, there we go, stick it out, uh, I need to get my cord, one momento, por favor, okay, that was connected to my phone. I just did something very stupid. Well, actually, not exactly my phone. It's a phone, but it's not activated yet. Um, I actually did a review on it the other day. Sorry. This thing is broken. I did a review on it the other day. And, um, but I have not it because 
been glitching, and I had it like 78% uploaded, but then there was a problem, and I do not have the time to upload it. So, same principles apply, you know, if you have an OTG cable, it will let you plug it into like something like this end. There's probably ones that have different ends, but, but if you recognize this end, or this will fit in there. It's kind of dark, I don't know. I won't be able to see it. Right around there. Okay, whatever. Let's get right into it. So, I'm gonna plug this bad boy in. Okay, it is plugged in. my stand okay great the tablet might have that no no work we're good we are good all right so I'm just gonna plainly plug it in wrong side sorry I have a different app installed so sometimes it does this there we go, I just pressed the button. So, see, it can move it around. The controls are actually the same. I mean, you can tell that I'm not touching the screen. And, I mean, as long as I like, just touch this little thing, I can move the guy around. So, that is it for today. Um. Uh, Hopefully you guys find this video helpful. I know it's not the best as some other people's videos, but I really do hope that it helped you. Uh, stay cool, guys. Bye.